Russian officials said that he carried out an attack using six drones near Zaporizhzhia nuclear power plant in Enerhodar, Ukraine. Enerhodar and nuclear power plant were occupied by Russia immediately after the full-scale occupation of Ukraine. Putin said 1,000 to 1,500 Russians signed voluntary contracts to join the army every day. The British Ministry of Defense said that Russia has recalled the stance of short and medium range air defenses around Moscow to increase Russia's ability to protect capital from drone attacks in recent days. After leaving Pyongyang on Sunday night, an armored train carrying North Korean leader Kim Jong-un came to Russia. He claimed that Vostochny could take place in Cosmodrome. South Korea said Kim said that he closely monitoring his activities in Russia and he would violate the sanctions given to North Korea through the nuclear weapons program. The Vatican said that Pope Francis will be in China from Wednesday to Friday. The Ukrainian peace ambassador Cardinal Matteo Zuppi, Ukrainian President Volodymyr Zelensky said that the world did not unite enough against the war. Crimes committed in Russia's country. They want to turn it into something common. Polish Prime Minister Mateusz Morawiecki called the European Union to extend an embargo on the import of Ukraine Egypt, wheat, sunflower and rapeseed. Weaponry The news agency, reporting that he referred four United States officials. News agency is close to confirming the sending of longer-range missiles full of cluster S. Kiev. Lieutenant General Michael Lowe, director of U.S. Air National Guards, said that first Ukrainian pilots trained on F-16 fighter aircraft before end of year could be longer than before flying war tasks. Putin told Ukraine that supply of F-16 jets would not change the war and that he would only drag conflict. The Swedish government said that according a report of the Swedish People's Radio, he would ask his armed forces investigate whether it was possible send Grepin Hunter jets Ukraine.